Remo, what are you... Why are you running... No. Hell no. Not in this weather. Hello guys and welcome to Vip King Gaming. I'm the Vip King and today we're going to be playing some more RimWorld. And uh, in today's episode I think we're going to finish off our little machining room here and we're going to start uh, kitting out our dining room. So yeah, let's get, let's get straight into it. Um, first we need to get some... Um, what's it called? Some blocks. Uh, slate blocks? Building blocks? Yeah. Uh, slate blocks is what we need. Yeah. Slate wall is what we need. So uh, we need Jackson to wake up. So let's speed things up a bit here. Uh, actually, uh, let's just wake him up. He's going to be a bit grumpy, but I want to get this started. So yeah, guys, um, I'm recording this uh, after I've uh, released the Starbound series. And um, yeah, Starbound 1.0 is out now. And you guys seem to really uh, be enjoying it. So um, I'm recording this straight after I've uh, just released the uh, second episode to it and uh, yeah I'm uh, I hope you guys enjoy it as much as you seem to have enjoyed the first one um, yeah this Rimworld series has been getting a lot of uh, I got a big a lot of love to, to be honest you guys have just been giving me a lot of love oh look at Jackson he's going he's working he's working hard and run up and down he's like a little machine I love it where's Lucas going where are you going what you doing he's wandering Mm. He's hauling slate blocks at the moment, so I'm guessing he's going to start building... Oh, he's just filling this up again. Uh, he's Now he's sleeping on some rocks. Seems legit. Um, well, I want to start prepping. Henry's doing a good job cleaning this up. Have we got power in this area? Hmm. Where is... Power. Here we go. No, we don't. So I want to run this. Down like that. And across to there. And across to there. We might as well, we might as well connect it across there as well. Why not? So, uh, so that will allow us to get power to all of these lights. That's why they're not currently on, and it's all dark and dingy in there. Um, and I want to put, I want this to be like kind of a dining slash recreational area. Ah, solar flare. So, uh, a solar flare has begun. The intense radiation will shut down all electrical devices. It should pass in about a day. Okay, that's that's all right. It's not a long one. I, I've had some that have been pretty long. Um, hmm. But it's alright, we don't, we, our guns are powered down anyway. The, these will, like, are not on anyway, but uh, our cooker, electric stove, should have more than, yeah, we still got 12 foods, we, we, we're alright. Henry's doing a great job of uh, just, like, tidying up the place. That's good. Very, very good. Lucas is hauling some more rock. Um, uh, she is, she was actually on a mission, like, she was, ah, she's gonna do what I was about to do, get to do, good, good, good job, Jello. Good job. Uh, but yeah, she was actually on a, on a right little mission, like right down here to get some of the um, some of the components that we're mining out. I think it was down here. No, here it was. Yeah, she was down there. Right little mission. So, that bit. I actually think we've got the roof zoning. Clear no roof. There we go. And voila. So, I think this is going to be like a little, yeah, a little machining area. I think that'll work out well for us. So we are going to put some floor in there first. What floor should we have? I feel like I want to go with metal tile again, but yeah, why not? Metal, no, we don't have enough. Uh, but there's loads out and about, so... Ooh, auto-saving. Uh, we've got some graves going. God, there's a lot... Like, we have only one of our own people is here. Uh, is it... Graham... Maybe, like, maybe I shouldn't have put Graham in with, like, all of these evil, evil peoples. There is Graham, the teacher, dead. Unfortunately, in between all the guys that have come to attack us throughout the time we've been here, but... Yeah, Graham was a good guy. Actually, no, I think Graham was a girl. Yeah, Graham was a girl. Does it, does it say? I think it was that one. Teacher. No. Info? Nah, I'm, I'm sure it was a girl. You can you can go back and check episode one, because uh, yeah, it was one of the originals, and uh, so it was Jackson, and who else was it? Jello, I think it was Jello. Yeah, Jello. Cold snap. Okay, so how cold is it actually? Minus ten. So that's one thing we need to consider now. Has everyone of our people got clothes? Henry, 
How are you looking? Uh, cloth t-shirt. That's not really good. So we might actually look at getting some tailoring going straight away. Um, because the, like the cold is is like just not good for our for our people. So let's go into do, 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 production and a steel hand tailoring bench. Uh, there we are. And we'll put that one there. Uh, and we'll put the machining table there. And I think that's good. Uh, and then we want to get some power in here. So we'll just run that straight up. Like that. And like that. And we also want to get some light in there. There. And there. That seems good. I like it. That sounded like, oh, drop pods right out the back. And what is it? Yorkie skin. Okay, well, we want that because we're actually going to get in some tailoring. So, yeah. thank you very, thank you very much, Cassandra. I, I thank Cassandra because uh, we're playing on Cassandra Classic. So our storyteller is Cassandra. And she kind of, or the AI called Cassandra, is in charge of what happens in the game. So whenever we get ready, oh, all our crops are dead. Great. But that's alright, I mean, we have quite a lot of, we have got more than enough food to last us through the winter, so our crops did as well, and uh, hypothermia, you need to just, mm. what, what is it going to tell me about, make sure their clothing is, <laughs> okay, so you need to stop doing that because I don't want you to go down with hypothermia. So work. Uh, you can go to research and we'll put that. So he should finish that one. He's yeah, he's probably... He he's working a lot slower because he's... Uh, yeah, he's going to go to bed. So is it actually warm enough in here? Like, how warm is it? Yeah, it's like 22, but we might want to just power that up a bit. Uh, 24 is good. And we'll do 24 in there as well. Critical. What? Who's? Yeah, Jackson. Why are you walking around outside? There's just no need for you to be doing that. There we are. Happy with that. Actually, I want to put a door in here. Because it's annoying that they have to walk all the way around. So structure and... Hmm. Let's do a slate block door, just because I think the wood door doesn't hold temperature as well, and I genuinely think that that's something that is put into the game, the way that they equalize everything. So I might actually want to change this. Cause how is it in here? Well, indoors will be like minus 12 now because of the <laughs> the fact that this is supposed to be going to zero. It's supposed to be going to minus two, but it's a cold snap, so it is really like genuinely cold. Mm, you shouldn't be out there really doing that. Uh, why aren't you? What do What do you need? Need materials? What materials? Mm -hmm. Steel. I thought there was loads of steel over here. Oh no, it's gone. Wow, we plowed through that. Okay, so let's find us. Oh. Remo, what are you? Why are you running? No, hell no, not in this weather. Hmm, uh, draft, just come up here, nonsense, where have you been going? Okay, I, poor mood, I'm not surprised, it's freezing, we're all determined to be outside, let's do that, right, you need to stop what you're doing, let's just get you indoors as well, oh for god's sake, uh, can you not, can you not research? What? I'm sure you... Yeah, Jello, you can research. We'll put you on a two. And we'll force you. Oh, for God's sake. <laughs> why did you... Why did you mind that? There was a... <laughs> what? <laughs> why did you mind that? Oh, God. That seems legit. Yeah, I'm not surprised you stood by the heater. God. Okay. Enough, enough shenanigans. Let's get, um, 
Let's get our, da, da, not steel stool, where's the, ah, there it is, steel table, but let's make wood. Uh, we'll put one there. Actually, we'll put them like that, uh, and then we'll get some wooden stools. I don't actually have that much wood. Oh, dear. Uh, it's all right, though. Actually, I can make all of this out of slate. Sorry, bros. Let's do that, and cancel. And architect. Slate blocks. There. There. And slate blocks. There, 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 and there, 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 and there. Brilliant. Uh, and then we want some... <laughs> right, they should actually have... Oh, God, you can only make them out of fancy materials. That's all right. We will also do... do, 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 do. Where's the... Oh, joy, here it is. We will put... Put that there. Wait, not steel. Don't want steel. We want less. We want. Hmm, I'm running. Actually, I should have enough. And then we'll put a limestone thing there. And then we'll put furniture. We'll put uh, da, 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 da. limestone there and. There. I actually think that one's facing the wrong way as well. Or is it? Only one way to find out. Click Joy. Go in here. Nah, eh, can only go one way. Seems legit though. I suppose it's just a square. With squares on it. <laughs> Furniture. Here we are. Limestone. And voila. There we are. Now they can start putting that together. <laughs> well, Jackson, he's finished the research. Uh, Mike. Okay, so the basics of working with delicate, complex electronics. This unlocks the high-tech research bench, comms console, and other research projects like tube television and crypto sleep caskets. Mm. Interesting. Okay, so let's go into the research screen and let's see what we can get ourselves as well. So, waters. Electric smelting could be useful. Hmm. <laughs> I don't know. Tell you what, guys. You can see here, so we've got Devil Strand, which is allows colonists uh, to plant Devil Strand, a slow-growing mushroom that yields a valuable plant fiber. Uh, we've got colored lights, uh, just decorative. Then we've got hydroponics, which is um, allows you to build hydroponic tables uh, to allow grow... Uh, to rapidly grow crops indoors regardless of terrain or weather outside. And uh, then we've got brewing, kind of a, explains itself, make alcohol. Then you've got smithing, build smithies for crafting metal weapons and tools. That could be quite useful because we've got a lot of people that are like hand-to-hand -hand fighters. Let's just pause this a second. Uh, tube television uh, allows the production of tube televisions, uh, which I think is just kind of a fun thing. Uh, carpet can put carpet down that is kind of good it improves the quality of the environment uh, and it also keeps heat in which is good explosive ids allows colonists to build improvised explosive devices based uh, traps for um, artillery shells incinerary kind of same thing again but with fire uh, and then electronics uh, electric smithy and smelters uh, that's where we can go out and we can find like chunks of metal out in the place and smelt them down and get the resources from it or Mortars. Uh, learn to build mortars which can lob shells long distances over walls. So, the reason why I just read all that out to you is that you guys in the comments below for the next episode can decide what we're going to research next. So, yeah, let me know in the comment section down below what you want us to research and even better, tell us why you think it's a good idea to research it. So, there you go, guys. I'll leave you with that. And that will do it for this episode. We've got a dining room come together. We've got our little uh, kind of smithing workstation area uh, going as well. We might need some more power. Ooh. But that's something that we can look at in the next episode. For now, this has been episode 11. I'm the Bip King. Hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. Join the, join the Bip King family on the social media. And I'll see you in the next episode. Peace.